Hi everyone. Today we will be discussing about the interview questions for the Novo Labs. So in this series of the interview questions, we do discuss about the questions for various uh, companies or uh, companies exams and interviews. Okay, and uh, today we will be discussing about Novo Labs, which is having around two thousand followers on LinkedIn. So today I will be discussing about what are the questions they ask for. A person having around uh, three years of experience. So first of all, when you will, you will apply for Novo Labs, you will get a uh, test link by the interview bits. So today I will be sharing my screen to show you what are kind of questions do they ask, and uh, you, so that you can prepare accordingly. Okay. So the first, uh, uh, so at first when you will apply, you will get the test link from interview bits. <coughs> which will uh, have a time of around uh, one uh, one uh, one hour and uh, twenty five minutes, I believe, and uh, it will ask you five questions. So uh, as you, uh, now you can see my screen. I'm sharing the questions list. Uh, for me, the first question was the even sum. Okay, before that, uh, I want to mention that uh, while attempting the questions, so you will have the options uh, whether you want to write the question with uh, PHP or JavaScript or uh, C, Java, Python. Uh, everything is available as option. So for me, the first question was event sum. Event sum is nothing uh, but just a very simple program that that uh, the system will input. You will give you the input uh, of a array of integers, and you have to find figure out all the event numbers, and then you have to sum them and you have to return. That's it. Uh, the very simple thing. And then uh, the second question was uh, max min for me. Which was uh, the compiler uh, or the system will give you a, a integer of array input. So you have to find out the minimum and maximum number, and you have to sum uh, like add the minimum and the maximum, and you have to return that. Uh, that's it. Pretty simple. And the third one was uh, ladder scenario. So what it was uh, like. Uh, uh in a array so let's say we see if you have an array of like a 2 5 9 and uh, maybe 11 and maybe 1 and uh, 5 okay so what will the leaders so like if i am considering the first element 2 i have uh, other elements as 5 and 11 etc as the leader in the next so it is not it will not be a leader element so the leader will element is the element uh, it, uh, in which the next items uh, in the array are not bigger than that. Okay, so the last item in this list, which is the five, will be always a leader item. Okay, and even if you'll see uh, eleven here in this list, eleven is also a leader item because after eleven we have only one and five, and none of them are bigger than eleven. So eleven is also a leader element. So in this case, what we have to do, you can return the array 11 and 5 so uh, this is the result uh, this is the uh, result for the leaders in the array questions and then the question was move all zeros to the end in an array okay so let's say we have an array of 1 0 3 9 0 in this type of scenario so here you have to move all the zeros to the end but you cannot disturb the uh, the other elements uh, uh, what does this mean this means that you will have the result are like this one three nine and then zero and zero so this will be this is how the output will look like the question number four and the question number five was some uh, some uh, pyramid printing thing like if it will give you the number four as input you will make the pyramid like this okay uh, so maybe something like this i have forgotten so that was the uh, the question uh, so it, it might can ask you some pyramid questions or some other kind of star pyramid and all so uh, if you are preparing from this you can also prepare for the pyramid things and then uh, and stuff a bit yeah that was a quick uh, quick test uh, video for the uh, for the novel lab Thank you for staying connected with me. So I'll be sharing the next rounds. Uh, if you are applying for Noble Labs, please do comment uh, so that I can uh, get no uh, get in uh, so that I can have an idea that you want the next rounds and all so that I can share the other experiences as well. Thank you so much. Bye bye.